Simon here with some more Ableton Live tips. This is something that's in all versions of Live, as far as I can remember, and we're looking at step sequencing. Really easy. All you need to do is I'm going to create a clip, double click, and I'm going to set to 16th notes, which it is by default, and I'm going to make a bass line. Make sure the channel's armed. I'm going to be using my cursor key to step through the sequence, press a key, and then directly after, press the right arrow, and then I'm going to press it again. And then I can press any key. And I can put a gap if I want. Put a gap. Try it with some drums. Step sequence in live. Pretty simple when you know how. And it's not the only way to do it. Check the rest of my channel for other videos to help you do things just like this. Thanks for listening. Thank you.